Hello, well no, have a night, and a why, because you listen to Mission Nutrition. And in this video we'll discuss iron, its main functions and sources of highest quality available to us. So iron is basically a mineral vital for proper transportation of oxygen throughout the body and is necessary for muscle contraction and energy metabolism. And these sources, these listed sources, are in direct reference to the recommendations of Dr. Sebe. Rest in peace. And by the way, according to Dr. Sebe, iron is the most vital nutrient, I believe, at least the most, yeah, most vital um, uh, mineral. However, I personally disagree. Like, I, I'd say sodium, aka salt, natural salt, that is definitely the most important uh, mineral, like if that counts as a mineral, <laughs> because without salt we can't retain any water, so yeah, we... <laughs> but besides from that, maybe it's true that iron is the most uh, vital because according to Dr. Sebi, iron is what binds all the other minerals together. But with exception from sodium, then I guess. Anyway, let's get to these sources. They are, in no particular order by the way, chickpeas slash garbanzo beans, spelt, dulce, tamarind, teff, Dried figs, dried peaches, goji berries, which usually also is dried, dates, not necessarily dried, prunes, amaranth grains and greens, uh, dandelion greens, hemp seeds, olives, burdock, and sarsa parilla, or maybe it's called sarsa parilla, I, I don't know exactly honestly, uh, but it sounds Spanish, so I guess sarsa parilla. And according to Dr. Sebi and some other sources that I've seen, claims that uh, sarsa parilla is the highest herb, like the one of probably the best source for iron available to us. And, and when it comes to these herbs in general, like drinking herbal teas that, that are rich in iron, it's like, like also check description for additional clarifications. Uh, but I mentioned there like, you know, although these herbs and fruits, like the, those are the best, the best things we can consume are like, herbal teas and fresh organic fruit with seeds on empty stomach. But that doesn't necessarily mean, as I've understood, it's, it's not like the, they don't have, we don't get that same amount of iron as maybe some denser foods like maybe spelt uh, provides, but still it's more like bioavailable to us. It still enriches us the most with iron according to my understanding. So yeah, that's about it. Um, and when it comes to, uh, oh, oh, also actually, like pretty much all of the approved grains, they are, they have decent amounts of iron. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to mention that as well. And now when it comes to excessive intake, well, first, I would say, like in most of these videos, it contains some grain, uh, some grains, nuts, legumes, or seeds. So I always need to mention that it's super important to properly um, wash and soak these uh, legumes, nuts, grains, and seeds in order to break down the anti-nutrients which in very small amounts actually is good for us, but in larger amount is 
not good at all for us. And then I would say when it comes to uh, well dried fruit, yeah, yeah, limit the amount of dry dried fruit you eat because it's yeah, it's not recommended to eat too much dried fruit, and especially for us skinny people, like us naturally skinny people, us vata dominant people. Um, you can watch my video on vitamin K. I break down a little what I'm talking about. It's from an Ayurvedic perspective. Uh, but in general, yeah, limit dried fruit, I would say. And um, then... Um, oh, also, yeah, limit the amount of olives you eat because of the high content of omega-6 fatty acids uh, in in uh, in relation to its omega-3 content but it's okay uh, olives are great it's great fat and oil in it um, but yeah it's high in omega-6 but it can be uh, counteracted if you also eat decent amounts of sea vegetable or algae, I think I pronounced it right, right, algae, uh, sea vegetable based or algae based omega-3 in the form of EPA and DHA. And yeah, that's probably it. Otherwise I'll add something in the end. So yeah. Also, like I said, check the description for additional information and clarifications and stay blessed and nurtured. Peace.